A nosy old hag? Ah! And I thought I was coming on strong with the ex-wives line. Sometimes you have to be firm to get the information you need. God damn it, ain't that the truth. You don't think it's strange that all these murders are happening to girls who've been out drinking? No, no. A broad drinks, she gets a bit tight, she starts mouthing off. This leads to that, and she ends up in an alleyway. It's a sad story, but this town's seen it play out a thousand times, Cole. Why don't you want to see a connection here? Because there are perfectly good real-life suspects for every one of these murders. We don't need to go looking for the monster under the bed. You think there's anything to the divorce angle? I've been through three, Phelps. And no big deal. After a while, you just numb yourself to the experience. But Angel, he's a young Latino man. It would hurt his sense of who he is. He'd see himself as a failure, a woman taking control over his life. Then she fronts him and he snaps. Works for me. That makes Angel a killer as well as a piece of shit. The fuck was that, blue car? Wiggling around? Only I'm allowed to do that. No, not me! That's what I've said, not you, That's just crazy. me. Oh. Nothing happened. We got teleported. We're safe. We can drive freely now. What can I get you? LAPD. Detectives Phelps and Galloway. Diego Aguilar. How can I help? You worked the bar last night? Yeah. Me and a temp guy from the agency. Did you have a woman in here last night? 21 years old, Hispanic, drinking heavily? We have a lot of ladies like that in here. But yeah, I know who you mean. Antonia Maldonado. Oh, what did she do? She was murdered last night. Oh, shit. Do you know her well? Was she a regular? Hell no. But she was good and tight last night, complaining about her old man. It's a story you get used to working in a bar. She was so hammered last night, she left a letter on the bar. I'll show you. Sam has taken me to Palm Springs for the weekend. Say, honey, what time do you get off waiting tables? What is this? Subpoena for divorce. Divorce papers? Did you open them? No need to. She was shouting about it and waving the letter around. Said she was going to show him. Okay. Don't give it back to him. Keep it. Don't give it back to him. Uh, let's start with the movement. No, let's start with the jewelry. We have evidence for the jewelry. Can you remember what jewelry she was wearing? She had a necklace. Some kind of religious thing, I think. You know, the temp guy would have more of an idea. She took the beer he served her and cried into it all night. What time did she leave? Can't say for sure. Definitely cannot say, hey, you lying motherfucker, you know where she left. But it's like his face, I'm hiding something or I'm trying to remember something, you know. I'm doing this just to look at his face from a different angle. Yeah, uh, don't know. I'm going to say lie and back up. You waiting for someone? What? The fuck? That's a lie. She left well before closing. You fed her booze and took her home yourself. Whoa, hold up. Look, I run a bar, okay? I don't know what you're getting mad at me for. Looks like I was mistaken. Where did she go? Give me something or the LAPD will start getting interested in this place. Take it easy. She wanted a cab, okay? And my phone was out of order. The closest one I knew was at the fruit market across the street, so I suggested she try there. She seemed reluctant. Investigate the fruit market. Nice. Did Antonia say where she was going when she left? She said she was going to serve the papers on the husband. 
said that would take the smile off his face. If you ask me, she was scared, and the drink was for Dutch courage. My what? What he just said does not make any sense. Because what he said is, she said she was going to serve the papers on the husband. The papers were at the bar. She left them at the bar. Huh? I guess I'm gonna say lie and probably back, back off it. I don't know. Does the paper consider to be a legal paper describing the divorce proceeding between victim and husband? That That's it? Okay. I think she met someone here. Someone who followed her. You're protecting someone. I swear on my mother's soul that if I had any idea who was involved in this, I would tell you. Okay. I believe you. It's nothing personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that. Look, now it gives me a fucking guilty face. Fuck it, I'm gonna doubt. I was about to say truth before, but now I'm gonna doubt. So you let a 21-year-old girl who was stone drunk just walk off into the night? I'm sorry about what happened, I really am. But I pour drinks. I don't claim to have the answers to everyone's problems. Thanks, you've been a big help. No problem. Hey, get the guy, will you? Where's the temp? We'll do our best. One last question. What size shoe do you take, Mr. Aguilar? A broad nine. I have wide feet. Say, honey, what time do you get off waiting tables? Where's the temp? A waitress. Can I have another spoon? Where's the temp? Sam has taken me to Palm Springs for the weekend. You said the temp knows about the clothing. Where's the temp? Did you cover my shift on Wednesday? I have an audition. Yeah, it's out of order. We know. We said it's out of order. Or is it just the paper that says it's out of order? Where is that goddamn place? Sir, do you work here? Sorry, pal. Just making deliveries. From where? Just pick fruit market across the street. A fruit market delivers here? Yeah, sure does. The Mexes love a little slice with their tequila. Fine, thanks. Oh, damn. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. Oh, something broke there. Wasn't me. But where's the fucking temp? I want to know more about the jewelry. Did she have the bracelet? Did she have the ring? What happened? Obviously she had the ring, I think. Oh, he's already in the car. Damn. He was probably telling the truth there. Fucking idiot I am. Come on, we don't need the car. Just cross the road. Hope to not get run over. Shut up, I'm crossing the road. Just picked. Oh, that's the name. Just picked. Fruit market. Shut. Great. We'll need to come back later, Phelps. Maybe somebody here saw Antonia the night she died. Wait, what? We just had the delivery, dude. Hello? I... You know what? I want this car. I like this car. It looks nice. We won't be able to answer any calls, but... This car looks nice. How about we drop in on the husband instead? See if your gut is right. I'll take a bar over a husband every day of the week. Oh, she has some heavy turns on this one. Meep, meep. 
Hey dude, what you selling there? This guy's sauce. This guy what? Wow, he lives really close to the bar. Ooh, I thought it was a hammer. It wasn't. Maldonado resist residence resistance whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, 304. Maldonado is an apartment 304. Yeah, great. Great flaps. You happy? You you did you did a very uh, detective work. Congratulations. Do I need a phone? Don't need a phone. Staff only. Hello? No. I'm not staff, I guess. Building supervisor. Uh, 304 means third floor, fourth uh, apartment, probably. Now this is floor two. I mean second floor. And this is a third floor. Phelps, this could turn ugly. Forget about knocking. Let's take our boy by surprise. Hey, what the fuck? LAPD, motherfucker, you're under arrest. Oh, shit. I got a hundred pounds in the water. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm, I'm click. What do you think? I lost my fucking hat, you motherfucker. I got nothing to say to you. Oh baby! <laughs> My partner knocked out! What the fuck? What the fuck, partner? Come on! Lights out, bitch! Damn, they got some decent shots in there. Cuff these sons of bitches, Phelps. LAPD, you two are under arrest! Call for some backup, Finbar. Finbar. <laughs> that was teasing by Flaps. Galloway, badge number 564. I need a prowl car at the apartment building 330 North Hill Street. Two suspects need transporting to Central. Your wife has been murdered, Angel. Antonia? Oh, God, no! Where were you last night, Angel? I was here with my brother the whole night, goddammit! You think I'd kill my own wife? We shall see about that. We should get the whole place going over, and then talk to the neighbors. Yep. Hat! I love my hat. And Phelps, I don't care that you just got smacked in the head. You don't call me Finbar. Oh, shut up, Finbar. Stop circling around me, Finbar. You're starting to look like Joe Biden. You ain't sniffing my butt. I mean, my neck. Whatever. Alright. So, what? whose hat is this? Pick up your hat, Finbar. Is this... Not everything here is going to be relevant. Are you sure? It's like it looks like a church place thing. Maybe it can be a more investigation place. You know what I mean? I go to the church, ask some people. Maybe we get some clues about the couple. I don't know. Detective work. You know? Just picked fruit market. I wonder if Angel gets all his groceries from this place. Hmm. Okay. El Dorado. The El Dorado must be a family favorite. Hmm. Is there anything to investigate here? Maybe the pickets. We had the, the picket thing. No? Okay. Nope. A blood. 
This will take some explaining. Yes, this will. Uh, it will. Come on. No, that's it. Let, let, let's hold hands. The fuck, Flaps. That's it. Jesus. Fucking Flaps. Maybe one of the neighbors took notice of Angel's movements. He's got no alibi. He's toast. Yeah. Let's, uh, go check up on the neighbors. Hello. What do you want? LAPD. We're making some inquiries. Make it quick. I worked nights. So you weren't home last night? No. I was at work. You know nothing about Mrs. Maldonado fighting with her husband? Those two? They're always screaming the place down. Thanks. Okay. Can we write it down as a clue, maybe? It may be helpful. No good. There's nobody here. Although... That uh, renting lady can be, uh, you know, we can base our story on. Hey, sorry about that. I I'm playing with my kids. <clears throat> LAPD, were you here last night? Yeah. My uh, wife and I are separated, and uh, I had the kids last night. I put them to bed early and went to bed myself. Thanks. Seriously? Flaps, why don't you ask him to remove the mask? He might be the fucking murderer. You do not know. Maybe he's a fucking pedophile. Hello. LAPD, ma'am. Did you hear a disturbance last night? Yes. Yes, I did. Mrs. Maldonado lit out of here and her husband ran out after her. You saw this, Miss... Aranda. I had the door open a crack. Did you see Mr. Maldonado come back inside after he ran out? No. I didn't. Thanks. We'll be in touch. I kept thinking you were going to call that one a nosy old hag too, Phelps. Well executed restraint. <laughs> I'm executing restraint right now, Finbar. <laughs> I love this. I fucking love this. God damn flips. No, phone. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Putting you through now. Phelps, badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? Messages, please. Message from Captain Donnelly, Detective. Your presence is requested urgently at Central Station. A new letter from the Dahlia Killer has been found. Thank you. Ooh. Now this is an urgent matter. Oh, damn. I don't jump. <laughs> I was meant to go through this door. Let's go, Flaps. No time. Do we take the red car? Time for decisions. <laughs> 